Hello friends, welcome to Engineering Study Materials. In this video, we will discuss about the CNC, that is Computer Numerical Control. Before going to this video, if you did not subscribe this channel, please subscribe this channel and also like this video and share to your friends. Thank you for watching. CNC CNC can be defined as a NC system for a single machine tool that uses a dedicated computer controlled by the stored instructions in the memory to implement some or all the basic NC functions. What is a CNC machine? Conventionally, an operator decides and adjusts various machine parameters like feed, depth of cut, etc. depending on type of job and controls the slide movements by the use of hand. In a CNC machine, and slide movements are controlled by motors using computer programs. This is the diagram of the CNC machine. It consists of a machine tool table, servo motor, two servo motors are there, feedback transducer, feedback transducer, a lead screw, this is the machine tool table. First, the components are basic elements, part program, program input device, machine control unit, drive system, machine tool, feedback system. First, the programmer prepares the part program and feeds it to the computer and the computer sends it to the MCU, that is the machine control unit and then ROM, it control program, execution program, RAM, part program, CLU. It performs interpolations, control output signals, amplifier, comparator circuits. This consists of the machine control unit. The machine control unit sends the instructions to the servo motor and the servo motor works as per the part program. To know the new position of the machine tool, feedbacks are used. The feedback signals from the machine tool is sent to the MCU. Then the MCU tells the servo motor to do the specific function. Types of CNC machines Based on feedback control, open loop system, closed loop system. Based on motion control, positional system, paraxial system, continuous path system. Based on power drive, hydraulic system, electric system, pneumatic system. Based on circuit technology, analog system, digital system. Based on positioning system, absolute positioning system and incremental positioning system based on axis identification two axis system three axis system four axis system and five axis system constructional features of cnc machines it consists of machine structure slideways guideways actuation systems feed drives spindle drives machine structure machine structure is the load carrying capacity that is the whole member of the machine and a supporting member of the CNC machine. Its function is to transmit only the forces to the foundation because if it does not transmit the forces to the foundation the machine vibrates the machine vibrates and uh, the damages are uh, more to the machine. Machine structure includes bed, column and other supporting numbers. Slideways or guideways. Functions to control the line of action of the carriage on which the tool or workpiece is held and to absorb the static and dynamic forces. Guideways should possess good rigidity, damping capability and wear or frictional resistance. Types of guideways. Friction guideways. Uh, the friction guideways are flat guideways, V guideways, dovetail guideways, cylindrical guideways, anti-friction 
or linear motion guideways are divided into linear bearings with ball and roller bearings, recirculating ball bushing guideways, hydrostatic guideways, as a oil lubricated guideways or bearing guideways. So let's get into actuation system. So what are actuation systems? The actuation systems are used to convert the rotational moment into translation moment. Translation moment is the to and fro moment. It includes screw and nut, recirculating ball screws, recirculating roller screws, rack and pinion. Feed drives. Feed drive is an important factor in the CNC machine. It is used to provide motion to the slide as per the motion commands. Types of feed drives. Servo motor. AC servo motor, DC servo motor and brushless DC servo motor. Stepper motor, variable reluctance type, permanent magnet type, hybrid type, linear motors. Then spindle drives. The function of the spindle is to deliver power to hold and to center the workpiece or tool. Spindle should be less in weight. If it is more in weight, the speed of rotation will be minimum. The accuracy of the spindle depends on the quality of the bearings. Characteristics of the spindle drive High rotational accuracy, fast dynamic response, excellent running smoothness, high load carrying capacity, compactness. So, thank you for watching. If you like this video, put a thumbs up and also please subscribe our channel and comment your questions below. Thank you.